got this feeling inside my bones. It goes electric, wavy when I turn it on. All through my city, all through my home. We're flying up, no ceiling when we in our zone. I got that sunshine in my pocket. Got that good soul in my feet. I feel that hot blood in my body when it drops. Ooh, I can't take my eyes off of it. Moving so phenomenally. You more like the way we rock it. So don't stop. Welcome to this week's edition of Blue Gator Buzz. <laughs> the scripture for this week is... But Jesus told him, No, the scriptures say people do not live by bread alone, but by every word that comes from the mouth of God. Matthew chapter 4, verse 4. Snack check for this week is... On Monday, Lyndon and Ryan. On Tuesday, Maggie and Henry. On Wednesday... Caroline and Chloe, on Thursday, Peyton and Gabby, and on Friday, Ashlyn and Zach. There's $5 free dress this Wednesday. This Friday is parent-teacher conference. You know what that means? No! no, 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 no. Happy birthday to the following people. Bibi on the 19th. Merritt on the 20th. Reagan on the 20th, Josiah on the 22nd, Olivia on the 22nd, Lewis on the 22nd, Ethan on the 23rd, Ava on the 23rd, Madeline on the 23rd, Hayes on the 23rd, Shelby on the 24th. Last week, third grade traveled to Baton Rouge. Fifth grade dissection and sixth grade roller coasters. Can you name the first 39 books of the Bible? Lark appreciates our donations. Thanks, Blue Gators. Middle school participated in a design thinking activity. These middle schoolers were recognized for going above and beyond. Thanks for a great night of baseball, Coach Landry. These students participated in the Lafayette Parish Honor Choir. Check out the downtown Box City in the library this week. These students learned how to hand stitch in Ms. Frederick's after school class. Middle school PE rocks. Thanks, Rock and Bowl and PE coaches. We love hearing about your accomplishments outside of school. These students participated in CYT Cinderella. We are so proud of our Blue Gators. Thanks to our teachers for offering amazing teacher treats. And thanks to our PTO for offering amazing experiences. Thanks, Hot 107.9. Ascension Episcopal School is committed to educational excellence in a Christian environment. Tweet all about it at Blue Gators. So say what you wanna go, say what you wanna go. My dad is kind because he once gave a, a homeless person a sandwich and he inspired me because he's so generous and kind to people. Me and my family were eating lunch and we saw an injured veteran that was retired. We decided to pay for their lunch that evening. My dad inspires me the most. The person that inspires me to be kind is probably my sister Anna Grace because she's always kind to me and never mean and she inspires me to help people. My grandmother inspires me to be kind because she likes to help the homeless. <clears throat> so when I grow up, I want to help the homeless as well. One time, my dad and me, we were driving our car going away from um, a place that we were eating at. And then um, after that, there was this lady. She was on the side of the road with her car. It was broken down, so we helped her push it to the side. After school, I went to Borden's. I got ice cream and waters. And then we went, we went to um, the street and we turned and this girl got into a wreck with somebody else. 
and she had dogs, and so we gave her water, we helped her up, and we got the dogs out of the car. This girl, she died in a car accident, and her parents decided that they would donate um, her heart to my grandfather, and he lived for another about 10 years, and it was some pretty happy years. The person that inspired me to be kind was a lady who helped me find my parents in Disney World when I got lost in a restaurant, and that inspired me to help my sister when she spelt her Shirley Temple. So there was this one time where I was at CC's and the people in front of us paid for us. So we paid for the people behind us in the drive-thru. Then there was this, this other time where I was also at CC's, but we went in. And this guy dropped his change, so I picked it up for him. One time, my grandma was putting up this really heavy painting. And so I went to her house and I helped put her painting up. And then later that day, she took me to Borden's and he got ice cream. The person I chose for this flipgrid assignment is my sister. Because she's my sister, she always helps me. Even though she's bossy, I know she just wants me to be my best. She helps me study, do my homework, and tells me what to do. One day, me and my parents went to a restaurant, and after we had ordered and ate, we came back and found out that the couple behind us had paid for it instead. When I was in Europe, I saw some people helping the homeless, so that inspired me to start helping the homeless. Um, my neighbor got his ball stuck in the tree and he's sick so he can't get it out so I climbed the tree and helped him get the ball out. Next week is Teacher Appreciation Week. How can you show appreciation? Email a video message to Blue Gator Buzz. For just one, act of appreciation next week.